the Indian Army requires state-of-the-art main battle tank, namely future-ready combat vehicle, to replace the existing tank fleet. It would be required to operate across developed, semi-desert and desert terrain, and in high-altitude areas, across the entire spectrum of conflict. It will be a technologically enabled futuristic tank, to cater for current and future operational requirements beyond year 2050. The main battle tank, FRCV, being the forerunner, will pave the way subsequently for a family of supporting platforms based on a modular approach and base platform standardization. On the other hand, India is also exploring Russian T-14 Armata tanks as China builds up pressure in Ladakh. The Indian Army wants to replace its aging Soviet-era tanks with modern, future-ready combat vehicles. So considering the future threat spectrum and the combat overmatch over the adversary, the government of India has intended to procure a total of 1770 new state-of-the-art technology-enabled tanks to operate in existing terrain configuration under varied temperature condition for the Indian Army. These tanks will be procured to remain in service for the next 40 to 50 years as the main battle tank of the Indian Army. The Defence Ministry has issued a request for information to seek information from the foreign original equipment manufacturers for participation in the Future Ready Combat Vehicle Project. The fresh request for information was issued after the Ministry cancelled the previous one, which was issued in November 2017, stating that it was technologically outdated. The last date of acceptance of receipt of response on the new request for information is September 15, 2021. As per the plan, these FRCVs will be inducted into the Indian Army in a phased manner by 2030. Now, with the rapid pace in technology, there are new threats to the tank, from the aerial dimension, with unmanned combat aerial vehicle, loitering munitions, and so on. The improvement in ISR has also made the targeting of land forces, including the tank, easier. The battlefield now requires all forces to operate in a synergetic and networked environment. The future tank has to be in synchronization with technological battlefield advancements and needs to once again upgrade and incorporate systems to negate intelligence surveillance reconnaissance systems, counter the new threats, and enhance the operational performance, using technology and ensure the victory of the land forces in any conflict. So, the FRCV platform will be procured under the strategic partnership route within the provision of Defense Acquisition Procedure 2020. With only foreign companies can participate in this project.